Hi guys, welcome back. This is I Am Warning. Um, today I'm coming up with you with a slightly different review. Um, this is a Polish firefighter um, ration. Slightly different than obviously a military one, but still uh, an interesting item all the same. So let's crack on, get this open, and have a look what's inside. Get this open. Uh, so this is breakfast number A2. Have a look. Okay, so got a few items here. Let's have a look at the front. It's got a picture of a cat on it. It's called Melko. And this is the condensed milk. We've got a accessory packet, which we'll open up in a sec. We've got some meat paste. Or canned meat, sorry. Uh, so we'll look into that. We have a fruit bar. A jam. A cutlery set. And a big old packet. Of crisp bread. So that is it. This is breakfast. So uh, let's see what the rest holds. Okay, so let's have a look at this accessory packet first of all. We have a 10 gram bag of white sugar. Some chewing gum. Let's see if I can see a manufacturer on there. No, there's no manufacturer on it. On it, a sort of moist towel up, a vitamin C candy, a small plastic bag, another white sugar. I believe that is an instant tea. This is the chicory coffee extract, and then we've got some salt and pepper. Not quite sure what you'd use it for, I'm presuming the meat. So now that's the accessory pack laid out, um, let's move on to a few of the other items. So the first thing we're going to try is the fruit bowl. Let's see, it's fig flavour, pretty much like some of the other Polish rations that I've, I've had. Uh, it will be covered in rice paper. And there we go. As I said, covered in rice paper with the fig filling in between. There you go. Just give it a taste. I'm a lover of these fig bars. I love the little bit of crunch that they put in there. I'm guessing that's down to some oats or, or some bit of biscuit, I don't know. It's got sunflower seeds, maize. It's got bits of peanuts in it. So it's a very well rounded little bar uh, a great snack that i'd possibly take with me in a pocket or in a bag to have while walking around um on the job sort of thing so again another winner for me always is in the polish rations they they do taste nice 
Okay, so now we move on to the canned meat and the crisp breads. Uh, one thing to notice um, about these is although the packet itself uh, says that it was due to expire on the 15th of the 7th, 2017, which was a little over 15 days ago, the actual items themselves, uh, for instance, the canned meat 2018 uh, and the crisp breads themselves uh, are 2019. Um, so there is definitely some some give over the over what the packet says. Okay, so let's move on and open up these crisp breads. They've been a bit smashed in postage, but I'm sure we'll get something out of them. Okay, so let's just pop that there a sec. So they look like a normal crisp bread that you could buy in the shop. So pretty normal. Definitely smell, smell more of whole wheat um, than, than normal. So let's, uh, let's have a crack open this meat. No hiss. This is pork, according to the label. And yeah, it's definitely pork. Bit of jelly and fat in there as well. Use the knife just to cut a bit out. Okay. I'm not too sure whether I actually like this or not, so I don't want to go using tons of it. Anyway, so let's have a taste. The meat itself has a little bit of garlic in it, which makes it quite a nice, refreshing taste. Um, so yeah, it's rather nice. I'll just try a bit about the cracker. That's um, that's quite tasty. That um, I definitely will be finishing it, and I would not be upset at all if um, if I had to eat that for breakfast. So let's give the jam a go. Again, another 2018 date. Right, this looks like a dark black currant, black berry jam. Black currant with some blackberries in, I think. Either way, I, either way, I do like the uh, the jams in Polish rations. I must admit. Okay, well, there we go. Let's give it a whirl. That taste is so good. I think I'm going to go for, for another bit. Okay. So, all that leaves now is for us to make the drinks. Okay, so onto the drinks. So, we've got some tea, some chicory coffee. This is a herbal tea, um, but all accounts, but we'll have a look anyway. And this is the coffee chicory extract. Mm, smells quite nice actually. Okay, so let's get that out of the way. Now, First time I had condensed milk from something that I oven wasn't in a tin in the UK, it was an Italian, it was a bit off. 
I'm hoping that this should be a little better. So, let's give this a squeeze. It certainly smells different. Just try it on its own. Now, that looks a nice light colour with no streaks in it compared to the other stuff that I had. So, it tastes nice. Very sweet, very rich. Exceedingly nice. So, as anybody knows that's watched any of my previous videos, I'm not a coffee drinker, but I'll give this a go because it's intrigued me. In fact, it's got chicory in it. So, I'll just add a sugar. Let's make it a bit easier for myself. Start. Now, before I put any of that in it, just have a quick smell. Now, again, not a coffee drinker, so please excuse anything that I say is obvious. It's got a sort of a burnt, a, it's like a burnt smell to it. So, uh, yeah, we will set that down for a second. Next is this herbal tea. Let's add a bit of water to that. Now, I haven't added any sugar to this because, one, I don't know the flavour. So, it smells just like an ordinary tea to me, unfortunately. Um, so, again, we'll be putting in the sugar. Not a great fan of hot drinks, but let's do it. Okay. Let's give these a whirl. Very, very strong, as I said before. So yeah, definitely burnt flavor, but also a rather woody flavor. Um, but uh, let's add some of this in. I presume that's enough. Okay, so definitely smelled the condensed milk in there and. find that the condensed milk doesn't go too well <clears throat> in hot drinks. I prefer just to eat it out of the tube, but then I suppose that's just me. Now for the tea. I think this could possibly be a red bush tea just due to the colour of it. Uh, but um, That's nice. Um, the sugar makes it sweet, <clears throat> um, and I wouldn't add any any of the condensed milk to it. I'd just eat it as it is, or I'll drink it rather, drink it <laughs> as it is. Um, so yeah, that's that's been the ration. So just to recap, we've had the coffee, the tea, condensed milk, some canned meat, some cracker breads, fig bar, you can really smell the garlic in that, that's really nice, and the jam. Uh, just as a little side note, that on the fig bar, bloody awesome. So, that has been a Polish Firefighters Rassen uh, breakfast menu number A2. Once again, guys, thanks for watching. It's been Iron One. If you like this video uh, and my videos, please hit the thumbs up and give us a like. Uh, please also subscribe to the channel. Um, I'm trying to 
do more rational reviews on a regular basis so hopefully there should be more comic content coming your way soon again thanks for watching guys and see you soon